our great God. In this moment of worldwide crisis, we kneel before you in helpless dependence, crying out to you about the COVID-19 coronavirus that has spread over our entire planet. Father, we cry out to you in prayer for all the people in the Far East and Western Pacific, all the people in Southeast Asia, in Europe, in the Eastern Mediterranean, in Africa, in the Americas. We confess that in spite of all our scientific and medical knowledge, this coronavirus pandemic is beyond our control, and we cry out to you for your protection and healing. We pray for your sustaining provision and protection for those putting themselves in harm's way to care for the sick and dying. We pray for government leaders and healthcare professionals devising strategies to curb the spread of COVID-19. We pray for those working day and night to develop a vaccine against this deadly virus. And we pray for ourselves that you will keep us from panicking and deserting our neighbors. Give us the wisdom and discipline to follow instructions and take precautions to avoid spreading this dangerous disease. We pray also for the economic impact the coronavirus pandemic is having on our world and on each of us individually. You said if we have food and clothing, we should be content with that. Almighty God, use this time of crisis to focus us on the things that really matter. Help us even now to be as generous with others as you have been with us. But Father, even in the midst of this pandemic, the deep cry of our heart as we bow before you is the spiritually lost condition of the vast majority of seven plus billion people. We who are praying to you now, Lord God, are simply sinners who've been saved by your grace. And we long for millions of others to have the same life-changing experience. And so we plead that you would use this current coronavirus crisis to cause men and women, boys and girls, to think about life and death, heaven and hell, and time and eternity. And we pray that many, many will come to a saving knowledge of Jesus Christ because of this time of worldwide crisis. So help us, your people, to share the message and love of Jesus with all those around us and around the world. We love you, Lord. We trust you. We worship you. And we pray all these things through Christ our Lord. Amen.